This one little device can do a lot and I bet if you don't have it you will end up getting this by the end of this video. So this dongle is Ori Split Extend. With this one device you can have two 4K monitor either duplicated or extended from your laptop. Not just that, if you use another same dongle then you can have four 4K monitors or if you add a third Ori Split Extend then you will have six 4K monitor either duplicated or extended and if you add a fourth one then you will have eight 4K monitors extended or duplicated to your laptop, gaming console or media player. So let me show you how to do that. Now I have reviewed many Ori products in the past and from my usage they are pretty decent quality. Now while I unbox and show you this dongle, let me briefly talk about the difference between an HDMI splitter and an extender. As the name implies an HDMI splitter will just duplicate your device on two other HDMI compatible display. So for example, if you have a restaurant or a business, a splitter can be helpful to duplicate your media display to other HDMI compatible displays. Or if you have multiple TVs in your household and you want to duplicate a media player on those TVs, an HDMI splitter will do the job. On the other hand, an HDMI extender is mostly used with a PC or a laptop to extend the laptop's or PC's display to other HDMI compatible displays so you can extend your workflow especially if you are a coder, security professional, stockbroker, etc. But the beauty with this Ori Split Extend is that it can do both for a budget price of just 59 US dollar. So it makes sense to get this over budget HDMI splitters which will still cost you about 30 bucks and if your need is to extend the display then getting this will solve the problem. So this device is quite small and pocketable just 2 by 4 by 0.5 inches in dimension and it's fairly lightweight. Here's the weight of the device for those who are curious. Now the cable is quite short but it's sufficient enough and it also has an OTG USB type A to type C connector attached to the cord which is really helpful as if your laptop has just a type C port then you can use this connector and if not then this regular type A port will do the job. There are these side vents for heat dissipation and honestly I have been testing these out since past 3 weeks and they have never been too hot to create a bottleneck despite of me editing videos from my laptop. Now there are two HDMI female port on this side. They are sufficiently spaced out for a hefty cable but I really wish if they were a little bit wider than what it is right now. Now in terms of specs, you can just pause the video to read through all these detailed specs instead of me reading out to you but few key mentionable features are that it's compatible with Windows 7 or higher, Mac OS 10.10 or higher, Chrome OS, Android OS 7.1 or higher and it's not compatible with iOS, Linux or Unix OS. This device supports a wide array of video format as shown here. And it does not play HDCP protected content on sites like Netflix, Hulu and others. And finally, it only supports display output of 4K at 30Hz or 1080p at 60Hz. So it's not suitable for gaming and graphic intensive tasks. Also very important, you need to install silicon motion driver on your device that you are planning to connect via this Ori Split Extend. For my laptop, I did not have to download as somehow the Windows auto downloaded it. I have attached the link to the silicon motion driver page in the video description in case if you have to manually download the drivers. With all that said, let me show you what you all are here for. Now I have this Asus Zenbook laptop which only has one USB Type-C port and the laptop came with this Asus dongle that has a USB Type-C port for pass-through charging, a USB Type-A port for peripherals like keyboard, mouse, printer, hard drive, etc and one HDMI port. So technically I can only have one HDMI display with this included Asus dongle. But now I have four of these Ori split extends and I have seven displays right here on my desk. Now right off the bat, excuse me for this cable jungle over here. It's all for this video demonstration. After this video, all this will go under the desk for a clutter free setup. Now let me plug in one of this Ori split extend and let's attach two monitor to see what happens. And voila, you can see these two displays are connected. 
now you can go under display settings to select from all these options here is where you can arrange the display to your desired placement you can even adjust scaling settings display resolution depending on your display display orientation and here is where you can select duplication or extend settings which you can also access by pressing windows plus p shortcut button you can even go in advanced display setting if you need to now in order for me to connect more monitor with these other three ori split extends i need to have more usb type a or type c port and i had this adapter which i got it from amazon for just 10 bucks and this basically converts one usb 3.0 port to times four usb 3.0 port and that is how i can connect more of these ori split extends so now let's connect four monitors to this laptop via two of these ori split extend and voila now i have four extended monitor setup again i can go under display settings and rearrange the display placement which is crucial for a fluid workflow setting so i can easily move the windows around you can click identify to identify all the monitors so it'll be easy for you to rearrange with all that done, let's add two more monitors totaling up to six extended monitor setup with this third Ori split extend. And you can see now I have six extended monitor setup and I can smoothly move windows between each of these monitor as I have rearranged all these monitor beside each other. Now we are not done here yet, let's connect the 7th display which is this portable display via the 4th Ori split extend. And boom, as you can see now I have 7 extended monitor setup. The 8th one is the laptop's display but if you have 8th monitor which unfortunately I don't, you can even connect that to the Ori split extend and unfortunately with macOS especially the latest M2 Max chip, you can only output 4 external display. Now I don't personally use a MacBook but this Ori split extend will also work with your MacBook. But you may not be able to extend more than 4 display dis depending on the type of machine you have and the number of external display it can support. Now you can also connect an Android tablet to two other displays but unfortunately with Android you can only duplicate, you cannot extend the display to the other to display but hey that's possible which is good for productivity with all that said here is my final wording for just 59 dollars this is more than worth it the price may change at seller's discretion but boy you can see that i can easily set up duplicated or extended 8 display with just one usb type a port from my laptop which is just mind-blowing now I do understand that not everyone will need this massive 8 monitor setup but this is to show you that if you own a restaurant or a business where you have 8 displays in your location you can easily output a video stream to all those 8 display with just 4 of these Ori split extend or if you need an extended home office setup you can easily do that with one of these dongle. The best part is it's just plug and play no additional graphic card or driver is needed and from from my one month usage I have never encountered any thermal throttling. This Ori split extend is most ideal for office use, normal day to day browsing, security professionals, stock brokers, etc. But it is not suitable for gamers. Now I have tried video editing where I am editing from one of the monitor and others are open for different folders etc and I had no issue. So definitely check out the links in the video description and subscribe as I have 600 plus tech videos on this channel and I bet you'll find a lot of interesting videos. Also check out these multiple monitor setup videos as you may find them helpful.